Welcome back to Level Up, brave viewers. This is my co-host, Kinley Hoover, and I'm Brandon Gannicott. What's wrong with you? My head hurts. From what? Did you fall down the flight of stairs? From when you and Travis beat me to death with Nerf swords. Hmm. But that was last week. I know! You would have thought that would have healed. Anyway, um, <clears throat> it's the season finale. So we decided to end on a high note with one of the most definitive shooters of all time, GoldenEye 007 for the N64. That's why we chose GoldenEye? Mm hmm Thought it was because it was either that or Farmville. Come on, Kenley. Don't you remember all the good times with your N64? Three-prong controller from outer space? Squinting? Straining throughout the night? I remember my eyes bleeding out of my head from the horrible graphics. The horrible graphics? Farmville doesn't have graphics. It lacks the necessary polygons. Maybe that's why it's a better game. Well, I, I for one, love cramped level design. I mean, I loved it in Halo, and I loved it in GoldenEye. The corridors, they are maze-like. I would say labyrinthine. I kept expecting David Bowie to pop out of a corner and sing a song at me or something. Yeah, but at least in Halo, there was room to side strafe. In James Bond, you're literally trapped in a small prison corridor. Yeah, right. And all the walls are the same! And I happen to not think that that's completely awful. Well, I happen to think you're an idiot. Ouch. This game features absolutely zero voiceovers. You get text boxes. We decided to do, uh, fill in the gaps that Rare left and dub it up for you. Of course, in this scenario, I'll be voicing James Bond. And I get the woman. Ew, it appears we are cellmates. Who are you, anyway? The name is Bond. James Bond. Natalia, feel do that Smirnoff. Job to meet you, Natalia. Tell me, why have you been locked up? They think that I am a traitor, that I betray my countrymen. And did you? Of course not. Ori Ori Yeah stole the golden eye. Colonel Arkivak Grigoryevich Nifle Oriomov? I've met him before. Oriomov is a gentleman! Ah! Oops. Probably shouldn't have killed her. How I miss cheats in video games. Yay. They actually brighten up the horrible experience that is GoldenEye significantly. Let's cover some of my favorites here. Invisibility, invincibility, uh, big head mode, small head mode, infinite ammo, uh, there's fast animation, slow animation. Oh, and my personal favorite, paintball mode. Yeah, paintball mode. Realism yeah. aside, I think they've proven that Rare just doesn't care. Realism. Kill the scientist. scientist. Oh, he deserves it. Look at him. Look at him. He wants it. it. He wants it. Face first. Ugh. Minimize scientist casualties. Completed. <laughs> he shot two of them. Right. This brings us to the ridiculous weapon selection. I mean, first off, let's cover the fact that they did at least have some attempt at realism. They have, for example, pistols, an AK-47, P-90. But then it gets a little ridiculous. For example, X-wing turrets, dual sniper rifles, Infinite ammo, laser pin guns, and a taser. Hey, I happen to like those X-Wing turrets. You get to dual wield them, for God's sake. You get to dual wield everything! <laughs> Including sniper rifles. There's no way that you can look through both scopes at the same time. Can you imagine how silly that would look? And just when they couldn't break the realism anymore, they also decided to break the Bond fiction. You can dual wield the golden gun. That's right. Apparently there wasn't just one. The movies got it wrong. There were two of them, and James Bond has both. Actually, more than two, because you could play multiplayer, and all four players could do a will of the golden gun, making a total of eight golden guns. Way to go, Rare. Way to go. Eight of them. You can also equip a tank. Tank? There's no. There's not even a picture. Tank! But Tank enough, is a weapon? It's there. Hey, you! Check out our tank! I'm a tank! <laughs> I'm James Bond. I'm a tank that walks like a man. Okay, um... This is kind of an aesthetic complaint, but oh my god, these guards are so ugly. They are literally the ugliest thing this side of Canada. Every now and then you find one that's not completely horrifying. But then you stumble across either the one with the eye patch or the one with a scar down the right side of his face. I happen to like the guy with the, with the, the, the broken nose that's leaning like 90 degrees to the left and he's missing most of his teeth and he just sort of looks at you with this this look of, of haunted There are longing. no way these things are creations of God. They could only be dreamt up by Satan. Look, don't blame the game. You know what Rare did. They took photos 
of people and then put those photos on, on, the, molly, on the polygon. I swear to God. Those you mean those are actually real people? Those textures are photos of real people that live. Hey, the score, the music, it's pretty good. It's essentially the same stuff that, uh, that, that played during the GoldenEye movie, which was, of course, up to Hollywood standards. Take that how you will. Um, so there's not much to complain about there. Yeah, I like it. Really? Yeah, the rock opening is pretty sweet. So you don't hate it? Nope. Hmm. Well, that's it, folks. That's the last episode of Level Up, and that was our review for Goldeneye. I don't think we could have ended this in a more mediocre way. No. I agree with you. There's no way that we could have done that any worse. But at least <laughs> you guys at least have the consolation that it's over. You are free. Until next year. Also, we are still on YouTube, LC Level Up, all one word. So you can watch our episodes all summer long. That's right. You'll have us in your house entertaining you, making you laugh, making you cry, making you vomit, whichever one comes first. We're not really picky. You, you'll probably cry and vomit. I always do. Um, but yeah, I think uh, it's been good. It's been good. Been a lot of fun. I like working with you. I hate you, Brandon. God, I hate you too. <sighs> Anyways, uh, join us next at next year. Join us next year when we level up.